Are your anthuriums beautiful glossy leaves suddenly drooping and losing their charm? Don't worry. In this video, we are diving deep into what's causing this and how to fix it and keep your plant thriving. First off, let's understand what's happening on a scientific level. Anthurium leaves stand tall when they are properly hydrated. Inside the plant, water flows through the stems and leaves via a process called tugger pressure. This pressure is what keeps the leaves firm and upright. When the plant doesn't get enough water or too much water, the tugger pressure drops, causing the leaves to droop. Now, let's break down the main causes of drooping leaves and how to fix them. Under watering, if the soil feels dry and the leaves are drooping, your plant may be thirsty. Anthuriums prefer evenly moist but not soggy soil. Drooping with yellow tips may be a sign of too little water. Water thoroughly but only when top 30% of the soil feels dry. Make sure your pot has good drainage to prevent water from pooling at the bottom. Your anthurium soil mix should be chunky, airy, lightweight mix so that the roots have space for oxygen. It must be fluffy. When the potting soil feels dry deep down, water your plant immediately. Drooping leaves with browning leaf tips and shriveling aerial roots are signs of underwatering. Overwatering. On the flip side, too much water can suffocate the roots, leading to drooping. Overwatering can cause root rot, which prevents the plant from absorbing water properly. Check the roots if they are mushy or have a foul smell. You may need to trim off the damaged roots and repot the plant in fresh, well draining soil. Yellowing leaves and the soggy soil feel are signs of overwatering. Stop watering and let the soil dry. Overwatering will also cause floppy leaves. Rhizoctonia is a root and lower stem fungus that weakens and causes young, delicate stems to become floppy. It typically occurs as a result of overwatering. Temperature stress. Anthuriums love warm temperatures but doesn't tolerate sudden drafts or extreme heat. Cool drafts from windows or air conditioners can shock the plant. Keep your plant in a spot with consistent warm temperatures, ideally between 65 and 80. Remember, if they experience temperatures below 50, they will begin to suffer and the leaves will yellow and droop. Low Humidity Anthuriums are tropical plants that thrive in high humidity. If the plant is near a heater where dry air is produced, it will experience too little humidity. If the air is too dry, the leaves may lose moisture and start drooping. Increase humidity around your plant by misting it, keeping water balls near the plant or placing it near a humidifier. Nutrient Deficiency Drooping can also signal a lack of nutrients, especially potassium and magnesium, which are essential for healthy leaf structure. Feed your anthurium with a balanced fertilizer every 6 to 8 weeks during the growing season, spring and summer. Mites and thrips are the most common pests of anthurium. They can be dealt with by rinsing the insects off the leaves. In severe infestations, you can apply an insecticidal soap on a regular basis to kill the insects. And here is something you won't want to miss. My pro tip for keeping your anthurium leaves upright and thriving. Repot your anthurium every two years. These plants love having fresh, well-draining soil and repotting gives the roots room to grow, keeping the entire plant happy and healthy. I hope you find this video useful. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more plant care tips.